Good evening, good evening, good evening. Good evening to all the students who are writing your board exam 2025. Yes, this is your Vani ma'am and I am there today to help you all and to show you how to fill your CBSE answer sheet for your class 10th and 12th. Okay, so this is a common and quite similar one for 10th and 12th. So those who are writing the board exam, before we start the video and before I show this specimen copy or this explain in detail, I want all of you to give me a smile. First, you give me a smile so that you will be, we will start the video with wonderful and happy happiness rather. All right, so all the students who are watching me, life, life is simple. Okay, chalo, let us start. But before I start explaining each one of them, one and each one, rather one and one, 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 one copy, whatever I'm explaining here, each one, I want everyone to remember three important things and understand carefully before you sit into the examination hall. Chal, let us first note what it is. Your examination, as I said, the most important thing before you start or reach, reach your examination center at least remember students because there is lot of traffic jam outside examination center at least to 1.5 hour before yes 1.5 hour one and a half hour before if you reach your mind your dopamine levels everything will be under control correct because examination tension your anxiety everything will come under control this is first thing next important thing please don't forget to carry your admit card. This is the most important thing for your board examination. Because, oh, board examination without admit card, nobody will allow you. Yes, because admit card, if you forget, again, you need to run to the center. You need to get your principal signature. You need to get your signature from the boards again. All headache things it is. Don't forget your admit card. Okay. Yes, important. Don't take Xeroxes. I mean, Xerox, don't get, get the Xerox to the examination center. Only original admit card is important. Okay. Third important thing, suppose your exam is starting at 10 o'clock. As I said, reach before one and a half hour. And one more thing, stationery is important. The stationery, you all know, careful. Stationeries are important. And you don't forget about the stationery. Don't beg because you will be caught in the examination no begging or no borrowing in the examination hall because again if they ask you to that you're copying and everything you'll be thrown out of the examination hall careful students you are matured enough i understand that fourth important thing careful whatever answer script you will be asked to be seated in your examination room at exactly be seated at exactly 10 a.m if it is in the afternoon one o'clock if it is in the morning 10 o'clock so you will be given your answer booklet yes answer booklet whatever is there you will be given your answer booklet once you sit in your examination or chair particularly answer booklet it will be given to you by almost at 10 15 a.m yes now 10 15 a.m your struggle starts and important thing to remember at 10 15 a.m your reading and everything of this answer booklet starts so most important thing your admit card so now i'm going to tell you in detail about how to fill first of all most important and the biggest star is your admit card is going to have lot of details i'll tell you what it is okay first of all your admit card will have your roll number your roll number that is a unique number every person or every student has correct your admit card has also your school number. This is also unique for everybody. It is different. Your admit card has something called center number. Okay, center number. The center number also your admit card has. Next, you have your and that too. The center number will be six digit number. Six digits. Okay. For few states, you know, for few states like, you know, your Chennai state or, you know, uh, Guwahati or partner states like that, Tiruvanthapuram, Prayagraj, for them it is only five digits. But for Delhi students and everybody, it is only six digit. Remaining for them, it is five digit. Next important thing, subject code also will be there in your admit card. So don't forget your admit card. Right. Now, in after that, 
after your admit card in the question paper whatever you are getting your question paper whatever subject you are writing that question paper has two different things that is your code number question paper has a code number and set number set number so it be that code number and set number will be now suppose this is the question paper on the right hand side extreme you will have a code number you will have your set number and that will be do, done okay first important thing this is clear students everybody clear now let us start in detail so don't forget your stationery admit card and everything any doubts ask me in the comment section now first important thing this is your 32 pages answer booklet this is the latest one which we have taken and that is 2025 answer booklet okay so basically when you see this answer booklet okay let me check first see see this now most important thing is you can use your blue pen or you can use your black pen ballpoint pen or gel pen will do okay gel i don't prefer normally but blue and black ballpoint pen safe and neat okay right suppose first thing now most important subject where is your subject this subject this subject whatever is there is in your admit card correct this subject is there in your admit card check the subject whatever is there that subject it is there in the admit card okay so whatever subject you're writing tomorrow today's english exam means please don't go and write chemistry exam your sub it will be messed up then your subject code your subject code also is there in your admit card date and day of the examination that also is there in your admit card if i am writing suppose chemistry chemistry you know when it is if you are writing english everything is there in the admit card please look into the admit card and copy exactly so medium of instruction suppose if my medium of instruction is there i will write medium of instruction as english is it okay so all done all done now first thing important i am coming i am finishing all this careful from where from admit card only i am doing hall ticket or admit card i am doing this and copying and writing is it okay all right now important thing is <coughs> code number they are asking you write code number as written on the top of the question paper yes i told you na if this is the question paper on the question paper on the right hand extreme there is a code mentioned suppose code number and set number both are mentioned suppose there is one question paper or any question a subject question it will be written suppose 58 by careful it the number will be written 58 by 2 by 1 will be written okay now in this 58 by 2 by 1 what is the particular code number careful and understand don't write don't don't mean a hurry write that thing 58 by 2 is a code okay and you have complete code so write that complete code 58 by 2 what is my set here set is 1 so you will mark completely you will fill this set as 1 is it okay completely don't blank put it about it should not be and it should not be bright it should not means basically it should not come out only i i have written because it is with my bare hand i have filled it don't fill it fill it neatly okay fill it neatly so that you no know, you are just completely filling it inside sorry filling it sorry i'll go back students oh, one second please now um, i have notifications i'm getting continuous notifications on the net so i will okay so you are going to fill it neatly like this like this and you finish it okay neatly don't leave any gaps and everything neatly you should fill it okay over then after that set number is over number of supplementary used this this you will fill it at the last once you fill or finish of your examination that one you will fill it at the last okay how many ever you have taken supplementary or additional sheets now this one is person with benchmark disabilities so those who have any physical disabilities in the your admit card the details will be mentioned admit card you know it will be mentioned that they are physically disabled so for them you should mark it it is not for you you don't touch this because if you don't belong to that for them as it is mentioned in the admit card they will mention it as s if suppose you are not not you belong don't belong to that okay let leave it suppose you, you if you are not writing means it is no if you want to still write you can write it as no and you are just simple because it is you don't belong to that you just leave that here physical disability is over now whether you are using scribe you know na scribe if you, or you are using any writer s or no so you will write no here over yes it this particular column is for if visually challenged students are there name the software used you are not using anything so leave it over now i'm coming to this next page careful students so don't uh, panic 
carefully now start now see here in the top of that thing after say, this one everything disability and everything is over now we are coming into this column now to be filled by the candidate as per the admit card careful okay so this careful thing very very careful all right so first important thing here you are writing your name okay to be filled by the candidate white and dark in the appropriate circle suppose the here it is the name what is my name here candidate name it capital letter my name is vani ma'am right vani potepalli okay so what will i do i will start v a n i vani leave one box then fill it p o t e p a l l i this is vani potepalli this is my full name total careful this total number of alphabets or this total will be only 22 boxes will be there let us count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 like that 22 only you need to fill 22 only will be there and that 22 22 letters only will be allowed this 22 letters you need to fill suppose if your name is bigger than 22 so what you will do you will put one box leave every for everything you leave one box and then fill means vani gap potepalli gap one more third name is there fill it if it is how big normally 22 is what they prefer according this is according to your admit card careful this is according to your admit card okay careful only 22 will be there now start now where is this v v v v v v v v is here so you fill it like this v slowly fill v okay then after v is over then come to a i'm because my uh, hand is bare hand that's why i'm not able to completely fill then n a v a n i n b c d f g h i j k l m here a m n it is here v a n i like that i'm going to fill i i'm going to fill i okay then after that leave a box leave a box because there is nothing leave that then pote pali p where is p p okay then fill this p then o where is o your o full completely please i am i am because again i am saying i am using my bare hand that's the reason it's little bit you know bravery then p o t a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s t t okay t then e then e is here okay then p then a sorry students this notifications are bothering me i don't know how to disable it okay p uh, uh, p a it's coming out please be careful p a l no it should not come out please so one in each box is what you are going to do okay one in each box is what you are going to do p o l l a l l both two two are there are fill it neatly please l l i b c d f g h i j okay so that's all. okay fill it completely again i am mentioning three times fill it completely okay so i am using my writing pad that's why it is little bit vague okay this is va pote pali so over students that's clear nothing now roll number your roll number is there in your admit card again i'm saying roll number in admit card don't miss your roll number roll number whatever is there how many digits roll number is there 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 suppose my roll number is 6 just for example i am uh, just telling uh, roll number whatever is there in the admit card 6 3 4 2 0 0 is my roll number suppose so you mark that 6 okay fill in the numbers then mark that three like that you understood right like that mark the complete thing for completely everything full everything should be filled that's my admit card this the where is this this roll number is in your admit card careful don't don't get tensed now subject code suppose subject code is that is also there in the admit card this is there in the admit card this is there in the admit card see it is written admit card this is also there in the admit card now subject core chemistry is 043 so i will write 043 center number student center number is also there in the admit card wherever you are writing this is also there in the center number is there in the admit card so take it fill everything and fill the bubbles fill everything fill the bubbles everything should be filled cross check this all you will be doing between 10:15 am to 10:30 am it should be over because your question papers will be given na so 10:15 to 10:30 it should be over now coming down coming here the subjects for example my subject is chemistry so i am writing chemistry is my subject 
okay so school number as per admit card this is also there in the admit card everything as i said your admit card will have everything so check that and write okay next roll number in words so that is also there in the admit card that is also there in the admit card i'm telling you know roll number in words also is there in the admit card check it and copy it once one is in crores one is in lakhs one is in thousands copy it then father's name a guardian name this is also there in your admit card and then signature of the candidate suppose signature of the candidate i am doing my signature and putting two dots all right now whatever boxes are there this you are not going to fill this is for office use this also is by office use superintendent and this is also by superintendent you will not touch this forget about these boxes you are not going to touch this is it okay so clearly i have explained everything so all the things wherever they fill the bubbles carefully cross check it you are going to do double cross check suppose if you are filling off and you you feel that everything is over there is one more instruction sheet okay instruction sheet is given behind that instruction sheet read this instruction sheet carefully okay no problem take your time carefully read it anywhere anything see here they have given on receiving answer booklets what you should do okay and after that what do not what do don'ts don'ts are there so if you are indulging in any unfair means what is going to happen everything all the things careful this is cbsc bylaws if i have to tell you if you anything is observed they are going to just abscond don't do that we have done our hard work right you are all wonderful students so please 32 pages are intact or not please check it once before you submit it okay or before when you get the book na as soon as you get your answer booklet those 32 pages are there booklet you get na answer booklet so once you get the answer booklet you see whether you have the 32 pages or not and that 32 pages intact if it is not there you can go to your head ex this one your invigilator will be there na their invigilator go to your invigilator and tell them ma'am i have not got 32 pages please exchange it they will cross check they'll do the cross signature exchange it and they will do a cross signature there okay cross signature they will do uh, saying that there is a damage and they will note it in there will be one paper they will note this in your paper in that in their paper okay students yes i think i have helped all of you i request all of you to first have or believe in yourself believe in your hard work this is very very important believe in your hard work after that next important thing is please smile how much ever you can smile smile because that gives me gives us energy third important thing please don't get don't get depressed okay don't get depressed nothing is going to happen students you have done your hard work na so that hard work will help you okay don't get depressed at all be strong what did uh, uh, modi say depressed modi said yes express yourself that is what yes he said express yourself when you express yourself what problems you have please they will we are there to help you out okay thank you so much for watching the video any doubt anywhere please ask me in comment section ask me in comment section i would love to help you all comment section i would love to help you all all right please like the video if you like it please share the video if you feel this is very important for all those who are writing board exams and please subscribe to the channel there are lot 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 of videos coming up thank you so much students bye bye again signing off with a beautiful smile thank you Thank mm -hmm. you.